Phantoms are standing by for permission to take off, sir. Let's not keep them waiting. Permission granted. Strike force launch. This is absolute lunacy. Sir, Supreme Command felt that a counterattack might catch them off guard. You don't approve of this mission, do you, Commander? Hmm? I think I've made my feelings plain. Hmm. Those men are risking their lives against an enemy that officially doesn't even exist. damage to the alien ship. Minimal at best. We haven't even put a dent in their deflectors. Forget the enemy, Colonel. How many of our fighters are down? Our data's very incomplete. Then put up what you've got. Well, these are the squadrons we've lost so far. Sound the retreat, General. Well, there's still someone left to hear it. Call off the attack. Hurry, bring those fighters home. All units, abort, abort. Disengage and return to base. Andrew's here. Good news, Colonel. The Security Council has been convened to consider your proposal. They'll have to listen to you now, sir. That strike force of theirs was a disaster, just like you said it would be. And the enemy fleet, is it? Completely undamaged by the Earthlings' attack. I see no point in our retaliating. It might very well upset our plan. If we don't respond, my lord, the humans may begin to doubt our superiority. Silence! Enough! The simulant. He's the key to our success. Thanks to him, we were forewarned of the Earth Fleet's attack. Thanks to him, the memory matrix will soon be ours. Once that has been accomplished, there will be more than enough time to demonstrate our superiority. Colonel Andrews proposes that Supreme Command go online with the EVE supercomputer and use it to develop and coordinate our defensive strategy. He further suggests that he himself be placed in charge of the computer. He is, after all, the only officer of command rank with extensive knowledge of the EVE. General? I find the proposal perfectly brilliant, Excellency. It's high time that that computer was put to its paces. I'm in agreement with you, General, but perhaps we should hear from the rest of the Council. Commander Emerson? Sir, a reminder the EVE is the product of an alien technology. It's a complete mystery to us. To trust it with our defense is madness. <clears throat> Are you saying we're incapable of maintaining control over this operation? I have my doubts. Anyway, I suspect that Professor Embry is not going to be exactly eager to hand it over. It's a military emergency. I'm sure the Minister of Computer Science, at least, has some idea of his responsibilities. That's enough, gentlemen. Inform Colonel Andrews he is in command of the computer complex as of this moment. But, sir.